Hey there, my friend. You know how we live in this world where everything seems to be moving at lightning speed? It's like we're always in a race to get things done and never taking the time to breathe and enjoy life. We have the luxury of ordering food, watching movies, and connecting with others instantly through our phones. But have you ever wondered if this constant rush might be taking a toll on our happiness and well-being? There's this idea called slow living that challenges the notion that a fast-paced life is necessarily better. It's about focusing on what truly matters, appreciating the present moment, and simplifying our lives. The concept of slow living isn't new. Philosophers like Henry David Thoreau and Arthur Schopenhauer emphasize the importance of living at a slower pace to achieve true happiness. In fact, Schopenhauer distinguished between two types of pleasure, the fleeting pleasures of the will, like satisfying our desires, and the more sustainable pleasures of the intellect, which come from art, science, and philosophy. Marcus Aurelius, the Stoic Emperor, also advised focusing on the essentials and asking ourselves if what we're doing is truly necessary. This practice can help us have more time and tranquility. So, how do we embrace slow living in our everyday lives? One way is to simplify our schedules, letting go of commitments that don't align with our priorities and making time for relaxation. Another approach is unplugging from technology and taking regular breaks from screens. We can also practice mindfulness and engage in activities like meditation and yoga to be fully present. Connecting with nature is another essential aspect of slow living. Just think about the Japanese practice of forest bathing. Slowing down and truly appreciating the beauty of nature can have incredible healing effects on our minds and bodies. So my friend, maybe it's time we give slow living a try. Let's embrace the present moment, focus on what matters, and live our lives with intention and depth.